can't see no either, can ya? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, do you reckon he feels? <laughs> Did you think it's in Braille? <laughs> well, that's right. You're just deaf, not stupid. <laughs> <laughs> you know, religion's the cause of all the trouble in this world, right? Religion, yes. Love, no. Yeah, you want some love? Oh, get him! Go, get him! Go, go. Get, get him! him. Go. Get him! Yeah! <laughs> Come on, we gotta go. We gotta go. Quick! Damn. Damon! Damon! I wouldn't waste my time here. Let's go, boys. Thank you. Jonas! Where have you been? I've been out running, Dad. It helps if I know the area a little bit. Well, I'm glad you can waste your time running when I need you here. I can't move all this stuff and unpack by myself. Did you think of that while you're out there running? Dad, you hungry? Dinner's hot. I think Nan's house is pretty good, huh? I remember this place when I was a little kid. It's good to finally have a place for our own, don't you think? Did you go to the interview today? I'm starting as a paper boy and couple of days. I remember mum always used to say that
run with endurance. The race. Hey, Samuel. It's a bearded dragon. I caught it behind the school. Ew. Isn't it a beauty? Billy, you really are a sicko. Hey, hey. is um, administration just through there? Uh, uh, going through the front door and to the end of the corridor to the right. Did you get that? He said going through the front door to the end of the corridor and then make a right. Look, it's a mute on a bike. Ugly. Down right pushing his luck. Oh, what's the matter? Feeling a bit emotional. Hey, come on, mate. Look, just keep out of my face, all right? And you do just fine, right? Leave him, Damon. Yeah? And what's this, eh? Oh, what, what do we got here, sir? Hi, right, guys. Oh. Hope everyone's playing nicely. Yeah. Of course, Mr. Walker. Walker. Yeah, right. Well, uh... What's it up? Guys, right? Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, do you guys know what room B203 is? Oh, yeah, it's, it's straight down the hall. It's third door to the left. Just down there? Yeah, third door. Thank you. Hey guys, if you can get your books out, please. Share if you haven't got one. Welcome. You must be Jonas O'Brien. Hope your lateness is not an ongoing problem. Take a seat. OK. We are continuing on with our discussions on the themes of belonging and how it is evidenced in our set text. Hamlet, Frankenstein, and Avatar, the film. Today we will examine some of our poets, looking for elements of belonging therein. Is this a biology lesson? Off to class! <laughs> right, I think it might be fitting for our new student to assist us today, Jonas. This way we'll be able to get to know you a little better and I'll be able to see if you can read a rare commodity around here. At the front. Uh, if you could read aloud for us The Enabling by Emma Gibbons, please. My desire is riding a whimsical breeze. My longing is soaring far beyond my trees. For what I desire, I do not, I am not. For what I long, I see not, I become not. I seek to empower with inner strength my honour. I yearn for the light, for the good of our brother. But my testimony alone falls far short of my goals. My desires refract, refrain, dissolve. Why is it I intend and cannot fulfill? Who is it who plays with my heart, my will? Does he laugh, does he jest at the failings we must? Should he flourish by my weakness, lost hope? Lost trust. <laughs> Mitch, go destroy the no zone in the hall, please. Hey, that one's for carbon tax.
For we are an intricate matrix, a web, interconnected, dependent, grafted to the head, entreated by one greater than inward desires, enabled in weakness, carbon in the fires. Great. Take a seat, Jonas. Okay, I hope you were all listening. because each and every one of you will be up here one by one reciting it. We're talking about regrets that haven't happened yet. Don't get me wrong, but I think we should settle for more. So, he's winning. I'm so glad looking at these boys with their shirts off that I'm the one winning. <laughs> You own him, but I want to rent him. Hey Joe, no sitting out, mate, up again. Come on. So, uh, you gonna play up there on that field? You gonna play? Oh, um, maybe later, I guess. Okay, Billy, all right. I don't know. Sit it up. All right. strain shouldn't be subjected to any more rugby blows. In fact, I would advise against playing it again at all. You're only given one set of vertebrae in this life, it appears to take care of it. If they're responsible for this, I'm going to tackle completely. <sighs> it's all right, this all. It wasn't your fault. I noticed how fast you were today. When you take up running, it's better, well, safer. Running? Running is for... For wimps and sissies, it's not like hey. oh. rugby. It's all right. it's okay. If you yeah, can't yeah. take a few knocks, what are you? Come on, look, it's all right. I'm fine. No, no it's okay, doctor. Really I'm fine. Need no. to stay for a few more hours but after not. No, 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 no. It's all right. I'm you fine. You must leave. I'm fine. You have to sign a release. Yeah, no, that's yeah. No worries. I'll sign a release. I'll sign a release. Thank you so much, Mr. Walker. Thank you, doctor. I'm so sorry. Thank you. Are you sure you don't want one, Samuel? No, thanks. Coffee makes me totally spaced out. It's not the coffee that makes you spaced out. No funny reptile, man. I love coffee. It gives me a pickup. Oh, there goes Joe. I need to get a paper for Dad. That dude's a paper boy? Well then, 
so. You must be new. Where's Jason today? Off sick? Uh, yeah, I think so. They kind of asked me to fill in for him. And what's your name, son? Jonas O'Brien, but people call me Joe. Well, my name's Harry, Harry White. Pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you. I'll get a daily telegraph, thanks. Sure. Sorry. Thank you. Uh. So do you think you'll be delivering the papers every week, Job? Uh, well, I'd like to, but I certainly use the job. I guess it all just depends on how I go today. Well, carry on. There's plenty of readers in this street. Yeah. O'Brien, did you say? You know something? I remember your mother. She was a very, very good runner. Mary O'Brien, Olympic qualifier she was. There's no one quite like her. Uh, I just wanted to apologise for my behaviour of late, you know. I, I just haven't been myself, but I think I got myself sorted. Yeah. That's all right, Dad. You haven't been so bad. Well, I just wanted to say, well, you know. I saw someone today who, uh, who knew Mum. Oh, yeah? Who was that? Yeah, uh, I, th I think he said his name was uh, Mr. Harry White. Don't know him. Hey, Dad. I was just wondering if you would sign this permission slip for the school running team. Just leave it there, I'll sign it later. Harry White said Mum was a good runner. What are you doing talking to strange old men for? Leave me alone! Hey, Joe, how are you? Um, I just want to give you back your things. Oh, thanks. Nice folds. <laughs> How's your head and neck? Um, you looked pretty bad at the time. Well, you know, just a few more days, I think, yeah. and a little bit better. Um, yeah, well, I better go. Okay. Bye. Yo, Grace, we've been looking for you. We're heading down to the beach to check out coastal landforms for the What can they teach us about coastal landforms? We live down there. Yeah, well, it's a good chance that she got the surf. Mm -hmm. Come on, let's go, eh?
Get off, get off, get off, get off the car. You're gonna compete today? Sure. Hey Grace, are you uh, competing today? Endurance. You better be up for the challenge, bro. She's not that easy to conquer. Oh yeah, I'm up for it. Billy, you really are a freak. Well, what do you expect? It's not like I'm going to sit around watching sport all day. <laughs> I'll take the time to catalogue a few. Maybe impress a few girls. Samuel, would you like a sip? No, thanks. Not good for my ailing heart. It makes it beat fast. Oh, ailing heart, eh? I didn't know you had an ailing heart. Well, no deaf. You're deaf. And very good looking. <laughs> Where's Joe? I thought he'd be here by now. 16 year old boys, 1500 meters to the starting line. Joe, but stop becoming. So guys, move forward. On your mark. Set. Get set. Go. Well done, mate. Zone competition in three weeks. Will do. Yeah, be there, mate, and turn up on time, please, <laughs> mate. Well done. That was a sensational effort, Job. I saw something brilliant there. You weren't fresh, were you? No. <laughs> Listen, you've got the makings of a very good runner, Job. And with your father's permission, I'd like to give you a couple of hints to get you to the next round of the school competition. Oh, well, my father is... I'm not really sure if I can find the time to do it uh, as he compete. With a time like yours, I don't think you're going to need too much help. Is that a good time? That is a very, very good time, yeah. my boy. <laughs> hey, Joe. Oh, hey. You going for a swim? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Good surf out there. Yeah. You're running brilliantly, Joe, but I was blowing away at the oh. carnival. Good set of lungs on you, there. Thanks. You want to do some surf? Ah, uh, what? Well, I, I actually don't surf. Do you really have a board? That's all right, mate. I've got a spare board, and I'm more than happy to show you. Oh, yeah. Sure. Yeah, that's if you can handle the cold water. 
These girls being my guest. We're all very experienced teachers. I'm sure the boys will be happy with that. Enjoy. See ya. Now, where should we begin? Charity begins at home, Grace. <laughs> what? Be nice. Oh. I was just saying how athletic these boys look. Grace, can we go? Seriously, everyone will be at my house by two. We've got at least an hour till lunch. We're going to teach these very nice boys to surf first. <laughs> Rebecca, you throw down your board and give Billy a few tips. Chantel, you take Samuel. Come on. All right, so lie down. Yep, yep. right on your belly.
hell are you doing rummaging through my belongings? I was, uh, uh, I was also looking for you, Dad. Where am I to help I get the message? Uh, Dad, I don't understand. Why don't you like him? Mom used to like him very much. She's just... Get out of my things and get out of here! Am I catching you in here and... Oh! Alrighty, uh, your event starts in 10. Luke, yours is starting in a few minutes, mate. Why aren't you warming up? Okay. Come on, get on with it, guys. Good. 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 I need $10 entry fee here, and there's no signature on this. Is your father here? No, sir, he's not. This is a zones job. I let it slide at the school carnival. I can't let it slide here. OK, you're going to need parental permission. Otherwise, you can't compete. What if I sign that? I'll pretend I didn't hear that, Harry. I need ten dollars as well. Luke, stretch your hamstrings. No, good luck. I hope you didn't mind me signing that form, Joe, but I just wanted a chance to see you run again. How do you know my mother? Your mother was a very fine runner, Joe. I was her coach. Um, I found this in our garage by accident the other day. Thank you, Joe. Is that really you in the article, Mr. White? Well, it's hard to guess with all that hair, but yes, that's me. <laughs> oh, wow. Harry White wins gold. I'm, I never realized you're an Olympian. I'm so sorry I didn't. That's OK. It was a long time ago, and not many people would. Well, I'm sure that many people would remember. My father doesn't seem to approve of you much, though. Yes, I know. We go back a long way, your father and I. You always resented the interest I took in your mother. Go. Well, keep the card, Mr. White. Australia Post promises to deliver. When well, there's not a strike on, of course. Thank you, Joe. And I promise to deliver you to the regionals and beyond. So, what's your event? 100, 400, 800, 1500. Oh, wow. That's impressive. What school are you representing? Canterbury. Ah, oh, yeah. I'm from Southern High. Do you know it? Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> All right, well, uh, I'll look out for your events. Lots to you, man. You too, man. On your marks! Set! There's a moment when we all 
Have to choose to fly or fall Here's yours I see you staring at the sky As the daylight slowly dies There's more you'll find What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? It burns, it breaks, it won't give when it takes, it's not fair. From her. Keep away from her. You don't have a chance with her. If I don't have a chance with Grace, then what are you so worried about? <laughs> well, we just uh, keep our differences to each other. <laughs> Talking to me, low life? Look, get out of my face! Why don't, you, why don't you go back to whatever country you came from? Hey, why don't you go back to where you came from? Come on, you can't make ships waiting in the bay. <laughs> You better keep your mates. Thanks, guys. How are you? Any time, man. All of you. Your name, please. Damon Dundas. Damon. Damon. Name, please. Abraham. Abraham, there you go. A new one, new name, please. Jonas so, O'Brien. Jonas O'Brien. Take this jar, Jonas. Then when you're finished, bring it directly back to me. Okay, thank you. Hey, Brad.
about it. I'm thinking about joining the athletics <laughs> team right now. On train? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Name? Is that right there? Mm -hmm. What's a bag for? Makeup. <laughs> Even you don't use that much. Ha 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 ha. I'm sorry, I don't know. <laughs> After dinner meet. <laughs> That's another race, Joe. Today's another day. My money's on the paper boy. Yeah, me too. He runs better than he serves. <laughs> <laughs> Off you go, son. Uh, Good luck. Good luck, right, Joe. Talented. Certainly is. And no one's saving you now, buddy. You're on your own. <laughs> Mark! Nationals man, white friend. You ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> Starting to look up, hey Dad. Huh? I just wish you wouldn't drink so much. What's this about? I got stuff to do. Well, it's regarding the school dance. Right? Well. Well, what? Come on, I got stuff to do. Don't you have something you want to ask me? Um, I'll pick you up at seven. Is that it? And make sure you look hot. <laughs> You're a real jerk. You're the most arrogant, selfish being I've ever met. What's this about? You never care about my feelings. You never do anything for me. What made you just assume that I would go to the school dance with you? Well, you're my girl. Yeah, well, it would have been nice to have been asked. That's what a real gentleman would have done. Is this about O'Brien? Yes, isn't it? You know what the difference between you and Job is? 
When Job holds my hand, it's out of affection. When you hold my hand, it's to stop me from getting away. Well, his favorite color's brown, I've asked him too, too many times. And while he writes pretty poems, I find anything that rhymes. And he sees right through me like you would not believe, says I like. I just want to say, well, I just want to congratulate you, Job, on a fantastic result. You should be proud. You run like a real pro, a bullet. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Mr. Walker hasn't stopped buzzing. Like, see his muscles strutting, you know? <laughs> yeah, well. He does tend to get a little overexcited, doesn't he? <laughs> Joe, would you go to the school dance with me? Well, I, don't, I don't dance really well. <laughs> you have two very good feet and legs. I think you can dance. Seven p.m. at my place. doing It's still light out. We'll be fine. Okay, we'll be careful. Have you got your phone? Yep. <laughs> I'll pick you up at 11, okay? Okay, yeah, Otherwise, we're never going to get there. I've kind of changed my mind about dancing. Mm -hmm. I could think of other things we could. Oh, well, really? <laughs> <laughs>
dance, yeah? Yeah, I'm, I'm here with Joe. What? Oh, uh, I'm here with Joe. With Joe? Okay, can you please go wait outside? 
Hey guys, you just step back a little bit. Stays on in on a brown and tree. I have no idea. Oh, it's all in here. You're a cheat, a disgrace. You've been disqualified from competition. Now I, I have to attend some stupid disciplinary here and make up some excuse as to why you cheat. As if I didn't have enough to worry. Oh, that's right. Turn away, walk away. Don't have the guts to stand and face me to. Speak up, dine up, just like your mother. I didn't see that coming. But I didn't cheat. It must be wrong. A mistake. If you want, test me now. I don't get it. Drug tests at high school level? They're conducted randomly these days. No one knows when. That's why it works if you take... Things are different now. Tighter. There must be a way to put this right. Come on, Joe. Billy, I didn't cheat. Grace. 
What do you think? A lot has happened, Job. I just need to process everything. I mean, Samuel's illness, you, drugs. How would Sam even get a drug? Grace, I wouldn't just... cheat. I just wouldn't, let alone use drugs. You think I had something to do with Samuel? I bet you sure you're all your drugs around, don't you? You and your crackhead father and that crapped old house of yours. But it'll make a living somehow. Look, no one's safe. Especially Samuel. Quiet, please, for assembly. Thank you. It is with great regret I bring the following information to the student body of Southern High School. Today, we have lost a friend, a valued member of our school, a wonderful student, a close peer to many, has passed away this morning. We're all aware of the events at the recent school dance and have been waiting anxiously for good news concerning Samuel Jacobs. Unfortunately today, Samuel lost his battle for life. He passed away at 10 a.m. It is his parents' desire to extend their gratitude to all well wishers. A number of teachers made themselves available to counsel and to talk to students. Please, avail yourselves of this, as news of this kind is never easy to process. When we lose one of our young people. Thank you, everybody. Assembly is dismissed. Once can you stop thinking about yourself? All you ever think about is yourself. Okay, I struggle too. I lost her too. You don't have the monopoly of grief, you selfish, self-centered. Wish it was you that died that night.
You don't care. You don't care for us. You don't care for me. You're a selfish God. You took my mother. You took my friend. They're all I had and you took them away. I don't believe in you. I don't believe you even exist. If you did, you'd care for me. What did I do wrong? You want me to trust you? This world sucks! Everywhere! Everything! I hate you! Prove to me that you exist! Prove it to me!
No, 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 like Brian, is that you? Jono, it's been ages. Mate, what are you doing here? You, you're teaching? You're coaching? No, mate. Who's we're... that young fella here? He, he'd have to be an O'Brien. Yeah, mate. This is my son. Hey, hey, Jono, any chance of getting us into your min block? We've got, uh, we've got something serious to sort out. Yeah, come on, mate. Yeah, we'll look after you. You, you follow me, huh? Come in, fella. I'm sorry, sir. There's nothing more I can do. Oh, that's ridiculous. My son's got to be allowed to take another urine test. There's been a terrible mistake. There's got to be something we can do. How about one of those DNA tests? Come on, Dad. Let's go. <sighs> Chips, eh? Hey, Joe, come watch this, mate. Dad, the movies you like to watch are always really bad. I guarantee you'll like this one. Sit. Pays to have mates who work in security. Joe. Sir. How are you, mate? I just got off the phone to New South Wales Athletics. You're in the clear. Yeah, there's video footage of someone swapping the samples. I don't know who it is, if they're going to catch them. But, mate, you can compete. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. It's a bit of headache, sir. <laughs> I bet, mate. Well, if you need anything, yell out. Sure. Good Thank stuff. you. See you, Joe. Joe, I've heard you've been cleared. That's great. Oh, thanks. Emma, yeah, it's OK. You won't really know. It's been awful for everyone, especially for you, Joe. I feel like such an idiot for doubting. I knew it is all along, Joe. Thanks, buddy. Billy, you are so lame. There's only one junkie I know of around here. I remember this one time at a party. He tried to slip something in my drink when he thought I wasn't looking. Before you came, Joe. Some stupid competition he had with his goon-headed mates. Are you serious? He will go to no end to humiliate a female if he can. You try that one on boys? No. You try that one on Samuel? No, he, he wouldn't no, do it, Joe. He wouldn't do that. Did you spike Samuel's drink that night? <laughs> oh, no, don't do that. It's the girls I like. <laughs> one in particular. Now I've got hers, nothing else. Grace would never be interested in someone like you. Drug dealer and a killer. I wonder what the police have to say about that. Is that true, Dan? I'll make it look like you did it. There's no evidence, you know. I'll make your life miserable. I'll hunt you down. Back off, you little...
ground. Sensational stuff. Life is the most difficult race anyone will run. You think God has deserted you? From where I stand, I see him close. In there. All around. Look closely. Joe. He's here. He doesn't hide. Where would your father be today if it were not for you? To me, you're always a winner. Getting a bit long in the tooth, mate. They're fantastic. Oh, well Give me hope, son.
Oh, that's cool. I like that. Together we had a cup. <laughs> Well done, man. Congratulations! Who's that with your memory? Ah, uh, Dad. If only you knew. <laughs> if only you knew. <laughs> Thank you, Mr. White. Thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, we come to you with one thing to say. I hope you hear it. Hope the melody is set on the play. I know it's true, and now I gotta try. That covers west to east and ocean wrapped in air sky. I found the reason why the sun sets with stars at their okay. I know this journey.
I am crying. 